Hi guys, and welcome back to Dawn of Man. I'm Riz the 32. So last time we extended, expanded our production a little bit. We now can make wool outfits, which is going to be handy. We've got goats being harvested. That's coming on quite nicely. Our food is sitting fantastically at the moment. We've got we've expanded our population to 52. We can go up to 63. Um, we've just gained another knowledge point, so we're going to go straight in and. I think we're probably going to go for flax. I'm not sure. Maybe pig later. Um, but what I want to work on today is... Oh, we got another Neo Farmer. Awesome. So what that's going to do, this has given us flax, which I'm guessing we can use to make linen with. So I did mention that I wanted... Does that mean that we can make... Well, a weaver will do that, won't it? Okay. That's interesting. And maybe the... We won't have our clothes production here. We can move that over to the other side and get some big flax filled. We do clothes and tools and we'll use this as our food. But what I want to work on today is I want to plan out how I'm going to start to get this settlement over here put up. So if we start off by putting a nice gate in by... Oh, that's a weird... Okay, well that's fine. So we're going to have to set it back a little bit so you can go in there and... Should be okay, I think. And this is going to be sort of our access between the two settlements that we have going at the moment. And then I'm going to want to get some walls in. And so we, there's going to be like a need for us to probably remove a few more resources. But it's going to give us time to actually come over here and do that. But we can come all the way. We, oh, we, so we can go through stuff like this. Okay, that's nice to know. If we come up to here, that looks, that's looking good. We can always add to it later, but I am going to go for a pretty big area, I think. This is going to be more of the main side. We could probably turn this into just a complete farming area, just food farming, and see how that works, and then look to have other stuff over here, like our flax, our main production, and that sort of thing. How is our workload? It's not too high. We're going to want to bring you a long way across here, like probably to there. I think that's fine. Yeah, that looks pretty good for the moment. We'll do that. And what I will also do is we'll just start to clear out a little bit of what's actually inside of the closed area that we started building. Now, this is going to be pretty big. We are going to want some houses over there. Otherwise, people are going to be traveling backwards and forwards. But I don't think the distance is too far, so it shouldn't affect us too much. So I think we just let them get this up and gonna need these trees being brought down that should be quite did quite good i also moved the hunting area that was over here as well so all that's going to come in handy and we can get storage so if we're just going to do food over here we're going to need to all our storage out and everything's going to be food based in here so we can get a nice we can still keep a weaver over here i still think that makes sense maybe quite possibly we should see and we'll see how that goes and then, so we, once we get flax planted, we're going to be able to build linen outfits. And then skins and things are pretty much obsolete. We don't really need to make skin and leather. But we will, we can still have the production capabilities for it. Maybe that could be something that we look to sell. I'm not sure if there's needs for it later on as we go through. I also want to move this bad boy as well. And we'll get you put down sort of over here. Yep, lovely. And what I haven't had a look at, I wonder if we can do this. So I noticed these platforms, and I don't know how they work. But let's put a couple in, and there must be a way for them to get on, to get on top of these platforms. We can't build along here because the um, arms are in the way. Is the word I'm trying to say there? So this is going to we're, we're going to keep people. Okay, we can't come down here because of the storage. So but this is probably going to be moved. But we can put you there. And we can put one in like that. Then what about on this wall here? I don't know how we access them, but we will find out once they're built. We have just given them a load of work to do. I don't know what these need. What do they need? They need logs and twigs. Okay, we've got a good collection of that going. And what I like about this area here is it has regrown. So I think that we can, once we get our like Stonehenge built up, but that will be after we've got this built, I think, once we've got our walkway through here. And then we'll fill this full of farms and have all our food production here. I think that's going to be the way to go. And we, once this area is set up, because it's going to be a lot bigger, we can get our tool production and everything on this side of the river. And I think that'll be really good. Um, are you going to be able to deal with this guy? You should be able to. 
Uh, I suspect you're not. Okay. You can run away. Oh, you got friend. You got friends coming to help now. Okay, brilliant. So we dealt with it. They are hunting a little bit away, quite far away from us now. But I think that should be okay. We should be able to deal with this quite nicely. Uh, these just platforms. I don't know how we get onto these. But we've got them in, so we'll see. I, I've like in my mind, you put them there, and they can just sit, stand on top, and people are going to get on top and attack the raiders when they come as well. They should definitely do that. We'll get those built, and once we're going, this this is going to be moved again, and that will help us. And building things seems to give us knowledge points as well. So even if we don't use them, I feel like they look better for walls. And what we will try and do on this side is we'll try and have it pretty much all the way around. Obviously, this section here, I don't think we're going to be able to have that. But that should be absolutely fine. I think we need a few more sledges. That's just a couple gone. The ones, there's still one to be built, but I'm going to add in... I think we'll probably add in another... Another four. There we go. Cool. And we'll get those done. Um, we've got a couple of people getting ill. It'd be good if there was a way for like a witch doctor in this. I'd like that. Neither hypothermia. That want okay so we we should have enough clothes for everyone but 12 wooden clothes what i will do those i'm just going to queue up i don't want leather just queue up a few more skim ones until we are in a position like that we just got another couple more so i just put another couple of those in there so these walls is coming along five knowledge points so we need 27 to go to the next era and then it looks like oh we can get the wheels so that's gonna be cool we'll be able to get carts we might push for that early on once we've got our iron, and that gives us quite a lot as well, which is going to be great. We get a couple of weaponry, we get charcoal. Okay, and we're going to do... So ideally, we survive the winter, lovely trader. Let's just do a little trade. Can we do a trade? What have you got? you got goats. I don't want goats, I want sheep. Okay, he can go then, that's not a problem. We're maintaining things quite nicely here. And so we're going to plan the main production... And are farming here, I think. Raider attack. We've got three more. We have got our our walls up, so that is fine. So let's sound the alarm. And get everyone ready for a fight. Now I wonder where they're gonna go to now. Be interesting to see like where they look to attack once Oh, everyone goes on the walls. Oh nice. Okay, I like that. I mean that's only gonna work if they come to this side of the So that's what they do there. Brilliant. Now I wonder if, like, once we have these all built as well, if they come along multiple walls. Um, I don't know where they're going because I've lost the... Okay, so they are going to come around this side here. I can see them coming through. Is that them there as well? Oh, are you my people or are you raiders? Okay, there's a few raiders then. The raiders are also going to increase in stature too. Okay, these are all my people running back. Are they attacking? Who are you? What are you doing, old man? inside no don't don't let them kill you we need to use our defenses the best we can okay so now they're going to come through and also they can't attack our people on the walls this is cool very cool and they are not lasting very long there's one more over here and there we go Oh wow, so we are dealing with the raiders really well now. So let's turn the alarm off. Didn't even need to lock our gates. There we go. Everyone back to work. Lovely. And that got us the knowledge points to unlock pigs. Brilliant. So we just need ourselves 19 more knowledge points to get to the next era as such. Okay, cool. And people have got a lot of work to do at the moment. But I think that's mainly down to farming. The last sheep died. Okay. So... Sheep has been slaughtered. Why did you? Are you full? I don't. I don't. Upgrade to stone stables require. Oh, okay. So you can upgrade them as well. Lovely. So animal limits. Goats give us milk. Sheep give us milk. So let's just have a look. I, if there's any boars around. So, ibex. You definitely a goat. What have we got? You're going to be goats, goats, goats. Maybe we'd slow this down. And then I'm guessing we can also eventually get horses. So you are all Ibex. Well, let's just capture you anyway. And I still haven't quite got my head around how that's going to work. 
What have we got over here? We've got pigs. Can we capture a boar? No, we can't. But how do we capture boars then? Oh, there we go. Cool. So we get ourselves a couple of pigs. And I wonder if they breed. Hopefully they do. What have we got? There's no sheep over here. We've got hyenas. I don't think we're going to be able to capture those. Good on flint. Last episode we were struggling on flint, so we seem to be doing okay on that tanning. Am I still gathering tanning from anywhere? I'm not sure we are. Let's have a little look at that now. And we are getting tanning, and we've got plenty of tanning. Okay, good. That's good. So we, so we shouldn't run out of that anytime soon. Um, oh, awesome. So all our... Cool, these are the walkway. All the platforms are coming along quite nicely. So, food we're doing really well on. Now, I wonder if the animals were running off because we had doors open and stuff. I don't know. Oh, there's one. Oh, old females. So when the, I think when the animals get old, they kill them. So how do I see what my animals are? So I've got 11. I've got four animals that need shelter. got loads of dogs, goats, donkeys. So it doesn't tell me... I've got space for 11, and I've got 12 animals. So maybe we need another shelter. I don't know. Let's get one anyway. Where was the shelter? I can't remember. Production, maybe? We the food dryer? No. Front mine, well. Tannery, hearth. Storage. Granary? No. Residence? Production. Where, where, where do we find the animal shelter now? It has been a couple of days since I played this. Not in the mortar. Spiritually, defense. Residence. Stables. Okay, good. That makes some sense in a way i guess so do we want the stables all by this walkway possibly not now i think i'm gonna place it here for the moment or unless we can sit you a bit further back like so yeah okay that makes a bit more sense and then we can push this one back as well once once we've got this one this these stables built i wish you could specify which animals go into the shelter um that would be handy okay trader now you got anything that we can buy from you? You have got a couple of female sheep. 168. I think we're going to struggle to do that. Bone harpoon. We don't need bone spears anymore. We've got a flint spear. I don't want to sell any stone, tannin, a flint pick. No, I don't think we're going to be able to do that. Are we? We could sell some slings. Drop you down to maybe five. I think that's enough. I've got quite a few flint knives, so I think, yeah, okay. So we'll take you away 66. We'll sell a couple of meat. Okay, done. Cool. We've got ourselves some sheep. That's going to keep our wool production up, which I'm wanting to get enough wool outfits for everyone. I think that'll be quite handy. So, how are our walls going on over here? So, stuff is happening. Um, we've probably run out of logs. We've still got 11 logs, so the walls are going to be built. I think once this section has been completed, we can then... Can we not tame? I have got... Pit we can capture you. Okay, there we go. So it's only the young... Okay. That makes sense. It's only, like, infant animals that we can capture. That, that makes absolute sense. Cool. Uh, we're struggling with wild donkeys, so maybe we get a couple of pigs. That'll be fine there. Get a couple of... We get a male goat. Young male. Ideally a young female. Yep, got you. Cool. Now we do that. Our workload's not too much. People are more than capable of this. Food is sitting in lovely. One has died of starvation. Is that because you were out in the mines too far away? Maybe. Okay, we need to bear that in mind. We're good. I need to... I don't think I can do much about that got a nice easy way across the river that is probably just because the ai kept them away too long or they got chased by something i don't think i can do anything about that so uh the fences are going up ideally it'd be good to have this as a nice square point but we can't do much about that got good defenses when they do come so we should be able to hold our own and we've got a decent amount of flint that's good I was kind of hoping to get a second or third one of the, the menes. I have queued up, so there's three ready to come in, which is what you can see here with the megalith. 
and that will help us there. Uh, level we're getting a bit low on. Okay, animals are escaping, that's fine. And how are we looking here? So we've got water, we've got plenty of hay. We don't need to worry about feeding our animals. And that is something that feeds us. I could get rid of this. How yeah, we've got space for five. I'm gonna get rid of you. And then what I also want to do is I'm gonna get rid of this tree and we're gonna put another house in here. We're getting close to I do need to we do need to expand the farms, but once we have this watchtower out, I can get rid of you and I want this tree gone and that tree gone. I'm gonna keep this one. Just this is kind of going to be a big farming area here. If I look at... I've got another person join us, so we do need some more houses. Okay. Where do we want some houses? I think we might be able to just kind of squeeze a few in over here. Definitely get one in here. Definitely get one there. Yeah, that's that's okay for me. And I do want... We do want a, a few more. So we can, I'm just trying to think how, we can have houses along here too. Um, I don't want these houses. I want to have our huts. Yeah, I think one here and one there is going to be fine. And that's probably slightly off-centered to those. That's that's okay, actually. I, I think that would look okay. That's going to give us another 15 people. So we should be okay for a little while. Um, workload is quite high at the moment that's that's fine too we will get an, another house in there and then i kind of we're, we're going to look to house people mainly over here now so this is going to be our entrance we are probably going to want some storage near the entrance we i want to do a big storage i wonder if the warehouse is where i'm going to be able to store like sticks and logs and those things and it'll free up these little storage slots that we have there like so that'll be good if it is but we will find that once we get on. We do need to get lots of things built before we can do that. Okay, we, we can take you down. No, you don't need to be repaired. Cycle is what we want. We've got a couple of trees in here. Once they've gone, that should help. Some nice little birds coming in there. I'm very fast, but that's because we're on times four now. We're just we're, we're whizzing along, kind of waiting for people to do things. Finish getting our walls put up over here before we move in. That should be fine. Got a little bit more space over here, so we can we can add to these walls slightly and just keep these coming down like so. And initially, I will probably just look to close it off around here, and then I could even put another door in so they can get access. I think we should be able to push on through all this here and make it absolutely massive. If the game lets me do that, we'll see. Wolf attack. Oh, world of pain. There we go. Goodbye, wolf. We've got plenty of meats coming in. We've got plenty of dry skins and raw skins. Loads of mud, so we should be able to throw houses up pretty quickly. You can see they're all ready to go. We're getting there close. And so I wonder if we planned to go something. Just I, I want to get this area like at least planned. How we're going to close it. So I'm hoping we can. Yeah, we, and we can come all the way through here. That's where the back's going to be. Not so worried about the trader at the moment, but we will have a look at him. Anything? A couple of go goats. We don't want goats. I could buy some clothes, but I think we're okay. We're not going to worry about him. Okay, cool. We we are getting there. What I do want to do though is I'm going to up you to four, and we're going to put you here. And then once we've got that done, we can plan this, start to plan this out. How we're going to have our houses in, where we're going to have our production storage. And things should start to... Oh, there we go. Let's, so we've no longer got problems. So we got space up to 68, 72. Lovely. And that tree has gone as well. So we'll get another resident in here if we can. Yeah. Probably squeeze another one in there, but we won't for the moment. It should be quite a little busy area. And then... So you're up and running, you've got loads of animals in you, you've got animals in you, so that's looking good. Hopefully we should keep animals around a bit more now, because I'm guessing you need to have breeding pairs of them, which is what, what we don't have with the sheep at the moment, but it's going to give us a nice amount of wool. Going to keep the wool clothes coming in. 
and everyone nice and warm in the winter. That is good. Okay, so now we've got some space here. I want to add a couple more farms. So we, what have we got? We've got Emma and corn barley. Okay. We've got these three. So what we haven't got is any of the, the I guess you'd call those pulses. And I'm not going to do, we're not going to do like massive fields for these. I just want to get, he says, as he does straight away, a six. No, we don't want to do that. I want to just get a nice little, little four of you in there. Yep. And then we'll get another little lentil in here. Yes, you're fit. Lovely. And this is where I, the farming is going to be done. Flax, we're not going to do over here. We're going to do elsewhere. We'll see how this goes with farming. We probably will need to expand it at some stage. But we can always look to have another little farming spur off. Even this area here would work out quite nice for farming, I think. That's going to keep the food sitting quite nicely. We won't have to worry about too much there. How are our granaries doing? They're quite bare at the moment. But I imagine there's a reason for this somewhere has died of starvation we can't be struggling for food because i can see that we've got loads of meat maybe we are actually struggling for food okay we are probably just on the cusp of it so these fields hopefully these are going to really help just get a bit of variety in there we probably need a bit more grains maybe we are approaching that stage where we're going to need bigger farming then i mean that's not to worry we've just put these farms up so we'll see how that goes Food wise, maybe we can get some more fish being caught then. I've got one here. We've got fish down here. I do. We are already fishing quite a lot. More fish down here. Put one in this area. And that may help us a little bit. There we go. If more fish comes in, I'm looking at it. And I guess maybe we just need more food. Definitely need more food. But that, I think this should help with that. And we just got a few more animals in. We've got pigs. So as long as the pigs breed, we may see this. Oh, goat's been slaughtered. Okay, so stuff it. We are doing okay, I think. I don't think we need to panic quite yet. We're close to it. We kind of... It'll be good to get... Like, can we ever get fish traps or anything like that? It does say they're netting. Does that just mean that they fish with nets? I wonder. I was hoping we could get fish traps. Or we could make beer. That would be good. Lots of knives. Oh, there we go. Fish traps. Okay, that's the Bronze Age. So we're a ways. We're still a ways off that. Um, let's speak to our trader and feel like we should maybe buy some food. What have we got here? Got goats. Not selling food as such. But no, we won't. We're going to wait on it. We are not we have not got much bread going on but did we have a bad harvest last year we've got loads of straw maybe we do need to get some more harvest going on we could look to extend down here or can we push out anywhere we can't really on this side um so it's going to be mainly over here that we can do stuff um wolf attack don't mind that deal with it dealt with Okay, cool. Another wolf attack. Oh, he is just obliterating them. Cool. That's what we want. I'm going to build a few more sledges. I think that's going to help us a little bit. We've got, we've got some that are being ready to be queued up. We are running quite high on the levels of people. So let's get a couple of these. A couple of the sledges. This just helps, I find, things move a bit quicker in town. So we'll get those built. Then really do with this area being finished i need more farming is what i feel like i'm looking at we, we haven't really got any grains or we'll see how this pulses goes with everything we have got we've got up quite a lot in population since in the past couple of epi episodes so maybe we just need to let that balance out and look to increase our food production i mean we could also tell people to where are you you gather out here, is that right? Do we have one out here? I don't think we do. Oh, we do. How are you? So, okay. So, we are going to be gathering wild crops as well, which will be good. And these are coming in quite nicely, so this is good. That's just in time. So, that's giving us berries, pulses. 
Do we maybe we need to, we're gonna need bigger fields. But I still wanna we're still gonna try and have the farms in here. Well we're definitely gonna have those farms there. They're they're doing fine there. And I think now realizing we're probably gonna need some sort of farming over here as well. But we can all we've got areas here for that to be set up, which should be quite good. Um what we can also add over here is we can get ourselves a bit of this. And that's going to help too. Yep. Uh, we just put a couple of people on you. Workload is sitting quite nicely, so we're not too worried about that. Uh, yep, people are still trying to build things. No one's going to got our manures yet to get them sorted, so we'll see how that goes and when that goes. And hopefully it won't take too long. What are you? Oh, these are my pigs. Okay, cool. The things are coming along, so there's horses here. There's definitely the younger animals that you can tame I guess you, you could domesticate I think is probably the better word um, we've got some little trees popping up in here but we'll do with those when you're just shearing a sheep lovely the animals do just seem to wander around nilly willy nilly wherever they want to and I guess it's just winter they come in but we're definitely getting there hopefully I think what I might do is oh yeah I think we may be able to connect up our wall yep we can so let's get you into here like so and then you can add the next bit of the wall along here there we go lovely awesome that's going to be our next sort of work area and once the walls are up we can start to move people in we can start to move our production over and pretty much all of this here will go so we will probably have an opportunity to get some more fields in here as well um and oh you're already running you're probably lost no, you seem to be doing okay. Quite good now. So cool. Yeah, so where are we? That's one of the hunting areas. Meat is going down, fish has gone up, vegetables have increased, so we'll see how this goes. We may need to get it may be a case of us straight away ripping this setting this up. We we'll probably want to set it up before we take it down and moving it over and getting I think we're gonna need more grain fields. Definitely need more animals. But we're not like declining on a massive amount. We've got 26 cured meat, those fried a lot of pulses, plenty of water, We've got milk from goats, loads of weapons, clothes for everyone. We've got more than enough clothes, so we should be okay. So I think I may. No, I don't think I was thinking about running the game, but I don't think we need to. We just need to. This will be built when it's built. We can start to plan the area out as well, and that should help. Has the traders got anything handy for us? We need a male sheep, so we could take one. We need 60 for that. Um, we sell a couple of slings, take you down to five, because we're just producing those. And we're at 40, so we need a little bit more. I don't want to sell straw, wool. I want to sell cloth, bone harpoons, I guess. We could use you. There we go, done that. Okay, so we've got a male sheep now. So hopefully our sheep will start to procreate and get us some lambs and then we can not have to worry about that quite so much but i think that's kind of that's everything i wanted to get done today we, we seem to be doing okay we're holding flints a little bit low but i'm hoping to get away from that and move on to copper fairly soon um we're well defended we, we seem to be repelling the attacks and i think once we get this second area set up we'll be able to really increase our production and the bridge has come out lovely so on that note guys if you enjoyed the video hit that thumbs up button comment below and subscribe to the channel all right, guys, take care. Ciao.